Hello everybody, and thanks for joining us for the very first Short Ride with the Stud. Uh, this comes from uh, ClassicContinentalWrestling.com streaming channel. Uh, it's, uh, it, this one is one of the stars of the sport. Uh, we do these with the great wrestlers, uh, and uh, we take a little piece out of each one of them. Uh, we call them a short ride because this is going to be fairly short. It's going to be f four minutes and 40 seconds uh, of the from the Andre the Giant episode. Well, he is the, the uh, star of this particular sport. Uh, he is the star of this one. And Andre, uh, Andre uh, was an amazing character. I did all these stories with Andre, obviously. He wasn't alive during this point. He was gone, uh, but uh, had some great, great stories. Uh, two hours and 27 minutes, to be exact, uh, of great Andre stories. So we're gonna have four minutes and 40 seconds of one of them and i uh, hope you enjoy it it's at a nightclub called the palomino club great big old place had a big huge horse outside the club it was a country and western club and andre and i like to go there and they had a big old horse a palomino just like a palomino horse but he was probably 12 feet tall. I mean, it was huge structure made out of, if not concrete, something very solid and no telling how much that horse weighed. And so we were in a club in 1979 in the Palomino Club and Andre's feeling frisky that night. He's buying beer and he's having people in the club buy him beer, buy him drinks. He would drink sometimes mixed drinks, but beer was his drink of choice most of the time. Occasionally he wanted something else. But that night, he was drinking a little bit of everything. He was really having a great time. It was a great group of people, and they were congregating around him. They felt his niceness. They felt that he's not going to hurt me, and they felt comfortable with him. And I remember during the course of the night, there was a big, huge girl there, and Andre talked her into taking her bra off. And I was like, what in the world are you doing, Andre? I'm... And I'm trying to watch out for him because I see he's getting really, he's having a great night. So he, he has the girl go take her bra off and she brings it back to him. And this is a big girl. So this is a big bra. And he starts out of the club. And I go, where are you going? He's got the bra. And I'm following him. I go, where are you going, Andre? He goes, oh, Ron, come on. We'll have some fun. So I said, where are you going? When we start going out, so does the club. They just start filing out after him. He goes out onto the street. There's that big Palomino out front. He climbs up on the horse. He gets on top this giant Palomino. He takes the bra and he puts it around the horse's chest and his neck and he snaps the bra on the horse. And then the crowds, now they're like 200 people out there on the sidewalk. And they're all cheering, yeah, go Andre, go Andre. I mean, it's becoming a little raucous event out there on the street. And I'm like, oh, this isn't good, right? I'm, I'm like, Andre, you know, get down from the, come on down, man. And no, run, no, run, I'm having fun. You know, so he's having a good time. And a cop car pulls up. Who got it? They get out of the car. And they don't see Andre. They're focused on the crowd. Like, what the hell's going on out here? So they pull up there. Maybe they call from inside and said, hey, we've got a problem out here. Come take care of it. So they get out. And the two cops happen to be get out pretty close to where I am. And they punch me. You know, and they go, hey, uh, what's going on here? And I don't want to draw attention to Andre. <laughs> if they would seen him, I'm not going to tell on him. So, you know, I, I don't know. I don't know. And about that time, one of them looks up and he sees Andre on the horse and he looks at the other cop and they look up at him and the guy gets on his deal, his little phone right there. And he says, we need backup. We need backup here at the Palomino Club. Right? He calls for cars. So another car comes, two more cops, another car comes. Finally, they wait till there's like eight cops. Now they got eight cops and they back the people away from the Palomino. Get back, get back. They're pushing the crowd back. And then they finally, after a long period of time, they start to talk to Andre. One says, and they know who he is, obviously. The cop in charge, I guess, he says, hey, uh, Mr. Giant. <laughs> Mr. Giant, would you mind coming down? And, and Andre goes, 
I'm having fun. The cop says, yeah, yeah, I know you are, Mr. Giant, but you can't stay up there on top of that horse. Or can you come down? So they finally talk him off the horse. When they talk him off the horse, then I get involved. And I was like, hey, come on, you know. And see, he's just having fun. And, you know, the, everybody in the crowd now, they're like getting a little antagonistic. If they're going to take Andre, the crowd's going to get nasty here. So I think they look around, they see what's going on, the potential for having a worse problem. And they say, hey, take him back in the club there and we'll let this go. Okay, there you have it. Palomino Club, Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, pretty good little story. A uh, pretty nice little ride. And uh, we're gonna have a bunch more for you. Uh, you can find these, classic, continental, wrestling.com, streaming channel, uh, four ninety nine a month or $39.99 for an entire year, which is about a little over $3 uh, a month. And uh, we continue to add to them continuously all the time, uh, more and more. The uh, channel's gonna be the best, uh, absolute best old school wrestling streaming channel in the country. So uh, thank you very much for joining us for this one and uh, be sure to look for us again. We're gonna give you another one real soon.